Hello everybody, my name is Faceless Suit and today we're going to be doing a reading your comments video. You might notice that the quality of this video is much better because I've switched to a different camera, a Logitech C920. I've also has, has, have a new mic. I forget what it's called, but I do have one. Before I did not have one at all or I would use my headset's mic. And so we're going to be doing, starting off the new equipment with a reading your comments video because why not? All right, let's get right into this. Let's see. Ass apple. Look at all those chickens. Look at them. Flocking their wings like they can actually fly even though chickens cannot fly. Here. Matthew Morano. Out of these three animals, bird, chicken, or fox, what is your favorite type of pizza? You know what? I think my answer to that question has got to be Aladdin. Aladdin's the best movie. Ah, this one, let me just give it a little bit of uh, context. This was from my skit, The Interview, and it says, Have you ever been caught? Now, if you don't or haven't seen my video, The Interview, you have to go watch it to understand this. But, no, I have not. I would not be making YouTube videos if it weren't for this. So, let us continue. Recite a poem with a much darker meaning than intended. I want to see this. From Papa's Fritas. First off, I love your names, potato chips. Or was it French fries? It's been a while since I took Spanish. Ah, uh, let me see. A good poem with a dark meaning. Roses are gray, violets are a darker shade of gray, I'm colorblind. That's good enough for you. Pam Dam, on a scale from 1 to 1,000, how do you like your eggs cooked? I need to know. You know, there was a question about chickens earlier. So this is going to be a little hard. I don't want to upset the chickens. I like my eggs mild. Very mild. I can't go for the hot eggs. If Chuck Norris can do it, so can the chickens. I completely agree. I think any chicken that's watching this is going to agree with me right away. No doubt about it. Those chickens have lives, you know. Before they're made into our food, they have a wife, a kids, maybe a working job. Gotta pay the bills for the eggs. You never know when you're going to need it. This one's a long one. <laughs> I like the person's name already. Son of a bitch. Wow. I'm gonna have to redo this. The beach is the best place to find a lover, so the ocean is where I go. You and me aren't thrifty, so we get all you can eat crab on the boardwalk. Come over and start up talking about the sea, and trust me, I'll give you a chance now. And I throw my hands up and start to scream because I realize that I just can't swim. Oh. You know, I thought you were going for Ed Sharon. He's all over the radio right now. If anybody turns on the radio, you know, most likely you're going to be listening to Ed Sharon. Every single time I drive, he's on the radio. It's almost annoying. I do like his songs, but you know, at one point he's going to run out of multiplication symbols or division symbols. All of his albums are either division, I forget the rest, but he's going to run out of symbols at one point, and then he's going to figure out something else. The astronomical symbols. Another one from Ass Apple. I'd fuck Shia LaBeouf. I did. Not really. Played the game though. It was great. I found this video quite enjoyable. Squiddy Saurus. Thank you. This is not a bullshit thing either. Thank you very much for commenting that you liked the video. I do appreciate that. This one's from Dare. I wanted to get this game so bad. I did. It was a great game. Lots of fighting. Lots of death. That's about all the games are nowadays. And you know what? We keep on buying them. It's all the government. That's what they want you to think. They want you to think you're buying video games. You're really just buying crazy simulations. Oh, this one's from Bazooka Tono. LOL. Okay, if you are in a public and you get a sudden itch in your nards and balls, 
How do you reach to scratch it? Left or right pocket? Listen, man. I get a back scratcher. I don't even care what people say. I keep a back scratcher in my back pocket all day long. And whenever that happens, you just take it out, shove it down your pants, and everybody looks at you really weird, but hey. Healthy advice commented. So funny. Hilarious. I'm guessing which one is you. Question mark, question mark, question mark, question mark. Uh, and you'll never know. Ever. Never. Uh, John Mayer. Happy face, happy face, happy face, happy face. It's great to see some positivity in these comments. I am loving it. David Nicholson commented. Cool live stream, man. I've been looking to, of doing one soon, but I haven't done it yet. Maybe one day. Well, you know, I hope you do. And when you do, I will watch it. Because I believe I am subscribed to you. If not, you will see that I am. Because I'll do that right after this video. Another one from Healthy Advice. How did you get the idea of having the name Faceless Suit? I mean, I like the mask, and I kind of like your voice, too. Being honest, music's a little scary. Well, I mean, hey, I don't blame you. I mean, this is a great face. This is a horrible way to start out this question. Um, I really thought of what is a great name. I mean, I definitely want it to have this. This, I want it to have him be my signature. But, um, I didn't really know what to call it. I was going through a ton of names. Um, I was thinking about, like, doing, like, anonymous suit. All these other things. And somehow, faceless suit just, like, rolled off my tongue. And I love the name so much that I just made it my YouTube channel. And ever since then, faceless suit. That's a story. <laughs> it came up one day, probably when I was in the shower. Because I think a lot about stupid shit in the shower. Suave Films commented, What's your favorite movie? I said this in the last reading your comments video. My favorite movie uh, is The Revenant. But thank you for asking. You should really check out the video, Mr. Suave. Uh, let's see here. Another one from Bazooka Tono. Like number six, I love these guys, for reals. Thank you. Uh, that was on my live stream with Game Hunt Reviews. Uh, that is my brother's channel, and I love them too. So, <laughs> I'm glad you really like us, and uh, we're going to keep on trying to do some collabs and stuff. It'll be really fun. And I can't wait to see what we come up with next. Maybe Black Week or something like that, because I know he plays that on his channel. And that'll be really fun, because I love Black Week. JMetal797 commented, Shit, I missed the rest. So did I. JMetal also commented, Nice, okay, my question is, If you couldn't play any games ever, except for one game for the rest of your life, what would it be and why? This is a great question. I'm going to have to take some time to think about it. I'm going to cut it right here. Okay, you know what? The game that I could play for the rest of my life, never get bored of, would have to be Call of Duty, Modern Warfare 3. Everybody always says Modern Warfare 2 is better. But before the hackers, Modern Warfare 3 was my favorite Call of Duty. And if it did not have hackers in it, it would still be. And um, that's the multiplayer was just great. You and I would have like the best people on there. That and Halo Reach. Big Team Battle, that was always great. I just love like those type of games. I like the first person shooters, and now everybody's like, oh, they're all the same. But they do have story, and I do like that. And the multiplayer is great. So, to answer the question, Modern Warfare 3 was a game that I could play for the rest of my life, and only that game. GamerX3 commented, thank you for putting me in a video. Lots of exclamation marks. Well, congratulations, you're in another one. There you go. And that's all I'm going to do for this reading your comments video. There wasn't too many. There was a lot more than the last one. But there definitely wasn't too many. I'd like to get a ton more. Listen, I don't care what you guys do. Comment any random things you want. If you saw some of the random things that I already just said, you know that you can comment anything and I will most likely read it on these videos. So, um, so keep on commenting, like, and subscribe. 
and I always do my content, usually on the weekends, for right now. I'm really busy, sorry. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye!